Ria and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to do the video star trend which is sweeping TikTok at the moment. This trend is all over the For You page so if you do make a video doing this trend you're almost guaranteed to get on the For You page. So let's get into the video. Okay so as the name suggests, Video Star Trend, you will need the app Video Star to do this. So this is what the app looks like in the app store on the iPhone. I'm not sure if it is available for Android, apparently people are saying it's not, but I'm not 100% sure, but this is it in the app store. It is free to download and every effect that we're going to be using to make this video is also free. So once you have found the audio, you're going to pre-film the video using all of the correct hand gestures ready for when we add the effects in. So this is what your video will look like beforehand. It will be you just doing all of the effects, swiping, pulling, um, and then ready for a slow-mo at the end. Once you've done that, you're then going to save that video to your phone. So if you have an iPhone, you can swipe up and screen record it from your draft or just post it as private and then save it to your camera roll. Okay, so now we're gonna to wanna to open up the app Video Star and edit the video that we just filmed and save to the camera roll. So this is what the app Video Star will look like. You're gonna click the plus button in the top right hand corner, edit video and select the video that you just filmed. So this is mine here. Set the start of the... I screen recorded mine rather than saved it with the watermark. And then click make video in the top right hand corner. So here is our video imported. Now we're gonna to wanna to split it into sections, so all the sections with the different effects. So we're gonna scroll along to where I push my hands out here, cause that's the end of the first effect. Click edit, quick split scene, and then split in the bottom right hand corner. Then the next part is the swipe to there. After we finish swiping, quick split. The next part is the end of the, the sphere, which is about by there and then all the last section is just your slow-mo okay so now we're going to start adding in the effects and as I said in the beginning of the video all of these are completely free so let's edit the first section you're going to click new re-effect clip and then click the plus button in the bottom right hand corner and you will see that they are all symbols in the bottom left hand corner a picture boxes a paintbrush we need boxes and what we're going to scroll across to is squish vertically which is by here and if you move this you can see that you can move it so we're going to start it quite slim because we want it to move out on the beats and then you're going to leave use the lever on the left hand side of the screen whilst we re-effect it so click re-effect and on each beat you're going to move the lever down a little bit So you're just moving it down on each beat, beat. And then at the end when you push it, move it completely down to the bottom so you've pushed it right aside. So that's the first part of the video edited. Now we're gonna edit the swipe. So again, click new, re-effect, the plus button in the bottom right hand corner. And again, it's the nine squares in the bottom left hand corner. And scroll down until you come to slides which is right by here and you're going to click the arrow because there's horizontal vertical diagonal we want vertical and again you're just going to click re-effect and use the lever on the left hand side to move it so re-effect so move the lever right up to the top then right back down to the bottom easy now we're going to want to add in the sphere so click new re-effect plus button in the bottom right hand corner and again the squares and we're going to scroll down to the effect called sphere which is right here so you're going to click on that and again use the lever in the left hand corner re-effect move the lever up and down and then our last section new re-effect and the four boxes. Now, people have been doing different effects on this one, so you can literally do whatever you want. I'm going to use the one right at the very end called Wiggle, because I think that looks cool, and quick fix that. And then I'm gonna add in some changing colors. So click New, Re-Effect, and this time, we're gonna wanna click on the paintbrush and scroll across until we come to a monochrome monochrome with a little arrow. You can move this to how fast the colours change 
I'm going to have mine there. So this is what the finished video looks like. So you have the squares going out, then you have the swipe, the sphere, and then the colour changing at the end. So this video really is really easy to do once you know what you're doing and now you know where to find the effects and they are all completely free. So I really hope this tutorial helped you guys. If you do manage to make a video to this trend, please tag me in the video as I would love to see them. If you haven't done already, please subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to follow me on TikTok to see all of my videos. Thank you for watching.